Question number one says, a 7.66 nanocoulomb charge is located 1.87 meters from a 4.46 nanocoulomb point charge. Find the magnitude of the electrostatic force that one charge exerts on the other. The answer is in newtons. Is the force attractive or repulsive? So here's what we have. We have charge one, Q1, is 7.6, 7 point six six nanocoulombs which is equal to seven point six six times ten to the negative ninth coulombs and q two which is four point four four point four six nanocoulombs or four point four six times ten to the negative ninth coulombs we have a distance that is 1.87 meters and now the only thing we need to do is set up uh, the equation for the force uh, the force from a charge so the force of a charge is equal to K times Q1 times Q2 over the radius squared which is going to be the distance in this situation K is 8.99 times 10 to the ninth, so that's not this, that's any situation. And the units on that, the units on um, K are going to be newtons times meters squared over coulombs squared. And so uh, you'll see that in the actual equation, coulombs, the, the charges, the coulomb squared is on top, so it would actually cancel that out, and, and the distance is on the bottom, so that would be canceled out, and we'd be left with newtons for our units in the answer. So we got 8.99 times 10 to the ninth times 7.66 times 10 to the negative ninth times 4.46 times 10 to the negative ninth divided by 1.8. 6 squared. Now just a quick look at the the uh, math. We got a 10 to the ninth, a 10 to the negative ninth, and a 10 to the negative ninth. And so whenever you multiply 10 to the ninth by 10 to the negative ninth times 10 to the negative ninth, you end up with a an answer that's in 10 to the negative ninth. Uh, we're going to divide it by 1.86 squared, so it should probably be an answer that's in 10 to the negative ninth or 10 to the negative eighth. And that's going to be your sanity check whenever you plug these numbers in your calculator. If you get something that's not 10 to the negative 8th or 10 to the negative 9th in that area, then you know you've plugged something in your calculator wrong. Now I plug this into my calculator, the answer I get is 8.78 times 10 to the negative 8th newtons. And it wants to know if it's repulsive or if it's attractive. Now, both of these charges are positive, uh, so we, we know that two positives are repulsive, and so that's kind of the logic there. The other way you can do it is if you end up with a positive answer, you know it's repulsive because two negatives on uh, up here would give you a two, negative times a negative is a positive, or a positive times a positive is a positive. So two like charges will always give you a positive answer, and two different charges will always give you a negative answer, and so different charges are going to attract.